So the first thing you need to do when, when, jail, when delaying your jailbreak is to make sure you have all your jailbreak tweaks installed, like cool booter and all installed. And I would only recommend doing this if you actually got, if you actually have like a certificate that expires like a week after a week, like my iPod Touch here does. So which you, and this could potentially crash your device. I'm not responsible for, and I am not responsible for any damaged devices. But I will try to help. But I will at least help if you if you end up getting a broken device to this, to this procedure. And this does not require any restoring. So what you need to do is you need to go into Cydia, go into the installed section down here and go into Cydia installer, click modify, click remove, confirm. And it might crash your device, so just beware of that. But I'll go ahead and speed it. Now I'll go ahead and get back to you once this is done. For a little bit, but now it's back to normal again. Again, as I was just able to press the power button and it turned on again. Last thing you want to do is if you have like a jailbreak app, just go ahead and delete that. And there we go. Now your device is back to stock again. And thank you guys for watching. And I do apologize for the for it being overall dark at this video. This video being overall dark, it was just sunny a few a while ago, but now it's fixing the rain, so so it's a little dark outside, and I'm right by a window, so not much I can do about that. But I've got my social media and my website linked below, and if you want to shout, by the way, you can apply for that on my website. And as all and as always, peace out.